Hello guys, Zuljin here and welcome back to another episode of Savage Lands. Hope you guys are having an awesome day today. We are still on top of the mountain as we left off here of what I believe is like the third island and there is the dragon like right above us. I'm looking around to see if I can't find any silver or gold ore. Uh, it's not looking too promising yet, although we have found just a ton of different stuff. I'm going to take on these guys really quickly. Thank you, shield. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Okay. Uh, let's take the bones here. Because bones is good for bone dust. Oh, man. And uh, apparently there's... Oh, there we go. All right. And bone dust. Yeah, I don't even have to make it. <laughs> All right. So I hope you guys are having an awesome day. Thanks for all the support, by the way, guys. I really do appreciate it. If y'all like the video, give me some tap on that like button, please. Okay, here's the monolith. So, this is a, another monolith? No, this is a repeat. I think this is the closest we're going to get to this tower right now. I don't really see another way up. So, let's make one more round just to make sure we've gone everywhere that we can in an upward fashion. Yeah, because this definitely just looks like... Yep, yeah, that's the lean-to that we made earlier. I don't think there's any way in here. I know, you mad. Don't Just don't worry about me, little crazy tree guy. I'm not worried about you. I'm trying to figure out how we get up here. You're just going to follow me forever, huh? Fine. You can come along. Just behave yourself. Only speak when you're spoken to. Don't ask for anything, either. Like... We don't want to. We don't want to upset these people, or this dragon, whatever you call it. All right. So this looks like the highest we can go. I mean, I can try. I'm gonna. I'm. I'm gonna get stuck up here if I try something stupid like that. I already know it. You're not supposed to climb in this game. You're just not. If it's not a road, you shouldn't go on it. Okay. So yeah, this does look like. The highest we've been. The monolith may have something to do with being able to go up there. But if it does, I have no idea. You would think that one of these little passageways had like a way in. Like a way up. But it does not appear so. This is an area that I'm not familiar with. Let me go a little bit further and see. I don't want to go down there. There's a tree though. That would be good for our lean to. But then again, we really don't need a lean to if we're not going to stay up here. You know? And my cold is getting a little bit excessive here. Alright. Trying to figure out if I should go down here or not. Maybe not. Maybe I'm going to go a little bit further. I don't exactly remember the way that I took up, but I think, no, this is definitely like going around in circles now. Okay, so earlier, this is where the two guards were, and that's where the monolith is. What about this? This leads downward, and that other place leads to... This leads to the monolith as well. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to take these stairs down on this side. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take the stairs down on this side. The first time I came here on last video, I decided that I wasn't going to do that. And also, while I'm here, I'm going to grab some, uh, some sticks and some wood. Just makes sense. There are a lot of sticks here. Good lord. That way I can do more lean-tos if I have to. Or even the same one if I pass by it again. A little low on my wood supply here. Still haven't found any rare ore, which is slightly disappointing. And it looks like this is the bottom of the deal here. I cannot go any lower? Oh, don't tell me. This is it? This is it. This is as far as it go. Okay, let's try the other side here. Because this side went down some, I think, huh? Nope. This side is the side that we went to 
before. Let me get some more wood. The least we can do is get rid of our cold while we're still up here. Alright. Wooden logs. Might as well get this uh, this tree too. I have plenty of space in my backpack, so it just makes sense. All right, there we go. This will be this will keep me good for a little while, then. All right, I think I'm satisfied with this now. I think I am. I can make sticks and all that good stuff and this right here I mean I can't go any further up or down right here so I guess this is pretty much nothing it was a little place for lore or whatever so <laughs> I know this is gonna be like suicidal or whatever but um, this may in fact be a shortcut to back home not necessarily super dangerous if I could stay along the rocks and stuff. That doesn't look like too far of a drop. Let's take it. I don't even know if you could take fall damage in this game. If you can, we would definitely take it going down there. <laughs> like, that just seems like plummeting to certain doom. This is a node. I just noticed. I'm not the only daredevil in the, in the world, I guess. All right, that's iron too. Holy cow. We are going to have like so much steel, y'all. So much steel. This is probably like all of the iron I've ever collected before, put together before this trip. I probably have more right now. That's a lot. That's saying a lot. All right. So it doesn't look like I could take too much of a shortcut here. Oh no, it's turning white. All right, I need to go where I can see. I need to go where I can see because if I get to an area that I won't be able to see at all, I'll be blind. This does look like more of a path. I think that's the safe way to go. And I was totally wrong. <laughs> well, right there I was. Okay, this is good. This is familiar area. I've already mined resources here. Yep. Yep, we're good now. All right. You have the skull and the human bones. Okay. Health is getting really, really low here. I do have enough stuff for a lean to. Even though I, I thought I had already made one somewhere in this neighborhood. I'm going to try to mine a little bit here. But let me see. Uh, lean to. Let's try to build another one. Oh, don't you give me any placing bugs now. Like, we really need this. Survival is pretty reliant on it right now. Come on, really? You're not going to let me place anywhere? We're dying here. We are straight up dying. And you're just going to give me placement bugs. Alright, I'll head further down then. I'm just going to press E a lot until something good happens. That looked like it might have wanted to place there for a minute. Maybe it just has to be much flatter wherever we go. Okay, that wanted to place. As weird as it is, we'll take it. Alright, I need sinew. Which, I can make sinew, right? Sinew, yes. With animal skins. Whew! Oh, baby. Ha-ha! <laughs> How about that for survival, ladies and gentlemen? All right, let's do some meat. Get our stamina cured back up here. Put our bandages back on. And just let the torch warm us up. Wow. <laughs> what a fiasco this has turned out to be but a lot of iron and at least I know what's up here so this apparently is not the third island I thought it was but it's not um, maybe it's across you know I read that it was across from the town on the coast and there is another town on the coast where we saw that big giant at 
um, which is one of the lofty goals that I have for an upcoming episode. I'd like to try to kill him. Someone made the comment that I should just get in the house and shoot him with a bow. That's so cheesy. Although, <laughs> it's a great idea. It depends how hard he hits. I guess we're going to have to test that out. All right. I don't know why my nose is stopping up all of a sudden. It's just like it wants to be... It's going to make me sound all stuffy. That's okay. I came out pretty good from PAX. Like, I didn't get sick or anything. A lot of people, when they go to conventions, they get sick. And that's one of the, one of the reasons is they just touch a lot of stuff that they're not supposed to. And then touch their eyes or their nose or their mouth. Um, or like, for instance, a VR demonstration. If you put a headset on that somebody else used before and they're sick, you're definitely going to get sick. <laughs> because it's like so close to your nasal passages and your mouth and your eyes. Anyway. Oh, it's one of those stupid things. I gotta be aware. I can't see out the back of this thing. I wish you could just brush the leaves to the side to kind of check it out. We only got a little bit left to go. Uh oh. Gotta get out of here. First reaction. First reaction. <laughs> that was kind of scary. Alright, now the storm is over. I feel a lot better about traveling now. Um. Yeah, we're not super full, but I'll take it. Okay, so there was some boots. Those were... I think we've traveled this path before. I mean, I remember leaving some boots at like a weird place or something. Yeah, I kind of know where we're at now. Kind of. Also, um, I needed some more materials last time I started a video, but I do want to make the compass. I know that that's actually a thing. So, this area is the middle island between... Yep, there's our home! I was about to try to sound all professional, too. And just to think, I did a lean-to just right there. <laughs> Alright. Well, we'll call it. At least we can make some, um, some good armor now and stuff. So, hopefully I have enough coal as well. I did, like, get, what, three nodes of coal? Is that nodes right there? I forget. I think that's just rock. Yeah, that's just rock. All right, we gotta watch it too, cause this this area, they have those like those golems that come out, rock creatures or whatever you call them. I don't know. It's, they're kind of weird. Okay, our torch lasted us the whole time too. Oh, there's one right there. They're actually not that bad. Like I can I can fight them pretty easily now. Let's go ahead and demonstrate that. Uh, see that? Nothing to it. Nothing to it but to do it. We know how to fight. I don't need no ice. Stone slabs. I've already got so much of that stuff. What is that? Is that ice? Yep, ice and stone. That's probably where I killed one early and just threw the stuff out. Alright. So, we should be able to get to smithing here. Get some smithing. Uh, Alright. Iron ingots. Let's do it. Uh, we have 15 coal. We'll save some for steel. Wow. Um, iron ingot. We're not going to have enough coal to do this, I don't think. God, no we don't. We're already... Uh, maybe we have a little bit of coal on the inside, but I, I, I really doubt it. Um, what? We got 20? We got a dub sack? Stack? <laughs> dub sack, I said. <laughs> um, let's see. All right. Iron ingots. And steel ingots. Nice. Okay, so... We can also go upstairs now and do... Steel rivets, I want to say. Or maybe it's steel rings. Uh, I forget actually what it is. Okay, let's see what we need here. We need, if we want a steel curase, we're going to need uh, two bags of steel rivets. Okay, so let's do that really quickly. Steel rivets. One, two. Okay, so we got steel rivets. That actually took coal too. I'm glad uh, we did that before. And let's see here. We're going to need leather. What is it? Steel. 
Still curious. I think it's studded leather. Studded leather curious. And that takes what here? Let's see. Leather studded curious, actually. Leather studded curious is two bags of tin rivets and two bags of tin rings. That's not going to be hard because we do have tin ingots. Um, all right, so we need leather strips, leather hide, tin, and tin. Can we make this? No, we probably uh, have to go downstairs to get the tin. Okay, I should have it down here somewhere. Uh, those are not ingots. Maybe I was smart and I put the ingots in the chest. <laughs> it's probably what I did. There's another steel ingot. We'll take that just in case we need it. Um, and where's all my tin now? There's iron. There's my tin. Beautiful. Okay. So, let's do... Let's go back upstairs. Come on, let me go. Okay, so we need 10. Wait, why is it not letting me do it? 10. Bag of 10 rivets. Oh, we need coal. You gotta be kidding me, man. You need coal for everything in this game. It's terrible. All right, we have a little bit here. I don't know if it's gonna be enough. Um. Oh, we have some more too. Excellent. I'm so glad I collect coal. <laughs> more than I even knew. Okay. Let's do this now. Ten rings. One, two. Ten rivets. One, two. Okay. So now... Oh, also, compass. We need iron and tin. Let's do that before I forget too. I just got an achievement for it too. <laughs> We're so late to the party on that. All right. Uh, so now, I don't know if we have the proper leather, which we probably don't. Let's go downstairs and get it. Um, it might actually be in here. It is... Oh, we had some tin rivets already. Fine, I'll take them. Uh, we do not have... Yeah, we do have leather hide. That's good. And we have animal skin. So we can make all that stuff. Plus, there's some leather strips here. Okay. We're probably going to have to go outside to craft this leather stuff. Yep. I knew it. Just die. Just die. I'm busy here. I am busy. Okay. We'll grab this stuff. Okay. So, leather. Leather. Hide. Let's make a few of those. And leather strips. And, okay, so now can we do studded leather? Do we have enough? No, leather studded, curious. Uh, the only thing that we're missing here is, oh, you need, <laughs> wait, that's kind of crazy. I guess because there's metal components in it. <laughs> I was like, well, we could just make it. All right. Yes. Leather studded. Oh, wait. Why? Leather studded. Curious, we're missing something. Crafting table required. Oh, it's the basic crafting table? It is. Dang, man. These dudes is relentless. Oh, no. I'm just gonna tank it. Okay. <laughs> Dang, man. Alright. Can we really do it now? Really? Leather studded curious. Okay. So, now that we got that, we need to do the steel curious. Steel. And for that, I need two more leather strips and cloth clothing. Which I'm pretty sure we can make like from cotton and stuff. So let's grab some of that. Cotton. There's a little bit of it. I know I have more than that. I also made a lot of fabric too. Okay. So let's do... Cloth shreds. 
Okay. Maybe I'm actually letting it down below too. I'm not too sure. Let's get rid of this bone dust and a little bit of this stuff that way. We'll make sure that we have it. Okay, so can I make cloth clothing? I can. All it took is some of those. Um, steel. Oh, leather strips. That's the only thing that we were missing. And we should have enough of that. Let's make... Ah, I knew it. Every time I come outside, it never fails. Never fails. Sheesh. Okay. <laughs> uh, where are we at? Leather strips. And I know we didn't need that many, but we're going to do it anyway, just so we can make it. Oh, this is going to be a heck of an upgrade, you guys. A heck of an upgrade. Steel. Curious. Wow. All right, so to put it in perspective, Steel Curace is damage reduction 43 and a warmth of 10 versus damage reduction of 15 and a warmth of 6. Plus, it looks epic. <laughs> it looks amazing. We just have a funny colored head and shield now, uh, which is no problem. Okay, so we already have a steel sword. We could upgrade to a steel hammer, possibly. How much steel ingots do I have left? I have three steel ingots left. So if I were to do, let's see here, weapons, steel, oh, we can do a steel mace as well. We already have a steel weapon. Um, let's do, oh, steel war mace, nice. Uh, let's do steel hammer. Very, very nice. We could do a steel hatchet too. You know what? It'll be a heck of an upgrade. Let's just do it. It'll help us chop trees faster and stuff. I know it's not necessary, but... Oh, man. Also, I'm going to go downstairs uh, to drop this off. But that is a heck of an upgrade. Bronze to steel on the hammer isn't too much. Uh, but it's better than nothing. Bag of ten rivets. I'm going to go ahead and drop some of that stuff here. Um, and let's see what the compass looks like here. Alright, I'm trying to figure out which way is north. Okay, that's north. Yep, from the look of it, that's north. Okay, good. Well, we know where we're at now. Now I may be able to read a little bit. Uh, where to get to the second deal, but I do want to go to that town and try to stir up some trouble But we're gonna do that next episode you guys. I hope y'all enjoyed this one If you did give me some dab on that like button to show you support and you could subscribe to the channel for more daily videos Thanks so much for watching as always. This is Uljin signing off and we'll see you next time